problem that I always have with the Phillips screwdriver is that it doesn't seem to want to turn the screw or the screw doesn't seem to want to be turned. I'm going to attempt to drive some damning screws with a big box bit. That one's kind of come to an end. We'll try this one. Not a very good looking screw, but we'll give it a shot. This is because the screw is fine, but the screwdriver was designed to cam out or pop out of the screw head when it felt any extra torque. It was designed to be used in an automobile assembly line, and General Motors used it in 1938 on their Cadillac. It is not designed to be used at the end of your screwdriver or your drill, because the harder you push, the better it was likely to pop right out and destroy your screw head. This is the problem that I believe we've solved with the knife edge bit. It has eight individual knives on it, four for each direction, some other enhancements, and when you put it in a screw and you turn it, it turns. This is a quick demonstration of my knife edge bit on some damaged screws as well as a brand new screw. First we'll start with the brand new screw and you can see that it will stay like new. Next we're going to do these three damaged screws. Furthermore, you no longer have to lean on it to keep the driver in because there is no cam out with my bit. It actually holds itself in the screw until you're ready to stop. Knife edge bit removing damaged screws. And now the new screw. Leave it there so you can see the head is still intact.